Hello, this is Richard with Sewer Sluice. Today I'm at 5121 Southeast 63rd Avenue. I'm located on the left side of the uh, house near the foundation. There's a 3 inch ABS two way clean out. This is going to be my point of access. I'm going to advance out, check the overall condition and serviceability of the sanitary sewer. We currently have the kitchen sink water on. We'll uh, flush the toilet once we get out to the main ladder on the street. Here we go. Okay, there's some standing water and debris here that we went under. We'll see if there's uh, some kind of uh, blockage that's creating this pooling or if they're settling. Uh, it's pretty full, just about the whole pipe here, and it looks like it's going to pop out up ahead. So about a 10-foot section that's bellied out. Um, we'll come back and revisit this area on the way back. Okay, it transitions to terracotta clay at the city curb right away here. Um, transition from ABS to the 6 inch clay looks okay. There's no root intrusion. Could have potentially had an older home here and then it was built, rebuilt in the, I believe the 90s with the newer home. Or they just had a lateral here available in the clay. And there's the main here at 82 feet. So we're going to go ahead and uh, flush the toilet, and then we're going to shut off all the water and give an opportunity for it to drain out, and then we'll revisit that belly. Okay, toilet flush came through here, so we'll let it drain out for a moment, and then we're going to pull back and see how much standing water is in that 10-foot section.
Okay, as we're pulling back here, you can see this area has got proper slope and grade. There's just a little bit of water trickling out in the flow line. That's what we want to see. We don't want to see more than an inch of standing water sitting in a section of pipe. If, if there is, then I'll recommend a spot repair to correct the slope and grade. <clears throat> we're at 54 feet right now. we got to work our way back to about... It's pretty much from 15 feet to 25 feet, roughly, uh, is where that uh, standing water is. But we'll see how much drained out and determine if any repair is necessary. Okay, we're getting closer to where that belly ended when I was pushing out. And we'll see how much water is left behind in there. Here's where the belly ended. So you can see there's still quite a bit of standing water in there, even with... Uh, all the water shut off inside the house. Pulling back slowly here. That's where it pops out. So it's actually about a six foot belly. There's a low spot in the pipe. I'm going to mark it and recommend uh, correcting the slope and grade here.